all secret paper hiding the stuff. Hey Free Gang, how's it going? We are coming to you live, but not live, from our front room. We're just having a nice easy day at home today. This could be a reset day, I don't know. We've had a, we've had a busy week, haven't we? Yeah, no, it's not really a reset day, and it's not really that we're at home all day, because we've got to go and pick Sam up later from the airport. Yes, well you have. Oh, just me then. <laughs> just me. Is that news to you now? Sorry. Yeah, yeah I've home. just got loads to catch up on. Yeah, Sam's been in Malta because it's been his boss's wedding. So I've got to go and pick him up from the airport. Yeah, Jamie's been out traveling as well. She's been to Alton Towers. Apparently one of you three gang saw her in a queue and she just didn't know what to do, bless her. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> she, called, she called me out, she's like, someone asked me if I'm from Family Freedom. <laughs> she just froze. Yeah. So if that was you, comment below. Yeah, well done. Yeah, well done for speaking to her and scaring her. <laughs> and guys, if you see Jamie anywhere in future, go up to her and scare <laughs> Tack her. Tackle her to the ground. <laughs> yeah, so she's been doing lots of traveling around, hasn't yeah, she? Yeah, she, but she went up to Blackpool as well recently, didn't she? Yeah, I actually miss her. I actually do miss her. Yeah, but she's having fun. She's enjoying herself, that's all that matters. And we've just been having a nice morning as well. Jojo, you've been doing some learning with him in the bedroom, haven't you? And yeah. you're in here as well. And you've been playing some weird detective game. Yeah. I'm just finding remnants of yeah. this game left around keeps, everywhere. He just keeps sticking, look, he just keeps sticking these stickers everywhere. Are they like clues or yeah, something? Yeah, they're clues. Is that a Lego man? Yeah, he's the Lego man saying, I can help you. <laughs> look at this guy! Can he help you? <laughs> Apparently he can. Mm. And what on earth is all this? This is stuff Jojo's been playing with. They look like random things, but they're uh, all... Are you telling me there's some sort of order to this? I don't know. This is the dinosaur. Ah, oh, the one that Sienna got him. That Sienna Lost got weight, for yeah. him, that he loves. A golf ball. <laughs> uh, the top of a cake that he made at a workshop. A Harry Potter wand. A bop it game. Ah, oh, bop it. Oh my goodness. Comment below if you have a bop it or have had one. Like uh, we had one, I had one years ago, and it's like the guy who talks on it is like, do it the same but better. But he doesn't do it on this one, does he? He doesn't say that. The no. old one he say that. What's he say on this one? Hang on. Hang on. It's not working. <laughs> <laughs> It says nothing. It says nothing. It's yeah. not working. But we love this. It's just yeah. an ornament now, isn't it? And nice pair of sunglasses. Oh, really? Let's have a look, Mike. I could have done with these yesterday. Yeah, they're a tad too small for your head, I think. I know. Could I be a sunglasses model? You look like a fly. Do I? <laughs> I love them. They're actually, they make everything look really good. Do you dare me? Free gang, who dares me to go out in public for a whole day wearing these? Are you suggesting some sort of crazy yeah. wearing sunglasses out in public yeah. challenge? shall I? 24 hour challenge. Comment below, free gang. You have the power to ruin this woman's life. <laughs> I don't know if I could do it. It's too late. You no, put no, it out there. No, I think you could do it, Bob. You oh, could do flip it. it. How did you turn that around so quick? <laughs> what the hell happened there? Seriously. I know you could do it. Vote. Vote who should do it. I think Bob. What? Her. You're, you're, her. You're, you're, Vote her. We've got five votes already for her. So, yeah. These <laughs> <laughs> We're a couple of minutes in and we've asked everything of these guys yeah. to move to heaven and earth. So, they're the things that Jojo's been playing with as well. So, so this is nothing to, oh, I thought this was to do with your investigating detective game. Ah, oh, I think it is partly to do with it. Okay. It says map on there. Ah, so okay, maybe just that is. Yeah. The way you named all of those things, it reminded me of the Mickey Mouse thing, you know, the Mouse tools. Oh, the Mouse random Mouse. things that they would get to solve things. It's what Judge used to watch. <laughs> he used to watch it when he was a toddler, yeah. yeah. A pair of big sunglasses, a top of a cake made at a workshop, a golf ball, Harry Potter's wand, and a broken puppet thing that no longer says the thing we like it to say. <laughs> <laughs> Enough of random Mickey Mouse stuff. What are you doing? You're eating your own head. Yeah, I don't know. You know you just get a random hair stuck to your nose? Yes, normally it's yours. Your hair gets everywhere. I'll just yeah. be like... Oh, oh, oh. oh, my hair looks greasy today. It's not actually greasy. It's just like I've got aloe vera on it. Because I was so, it was really hot yesterday because I get burnt really easily. I had my jacket on, I kept facing away from the sun and everything. And then the hairline, the one <laughs> tiny exposed bit, gets like completely burnt. And I'm actually scared that no hair will grow there now. Yeah, I didn't yeah. even think it was burning weather. I know, yeah. but anyway, that happened. And I've got aloe vera all over my scalp now. So. Talking of heads and hair, and no one called Vera, you're supposed to be cutting my hair, aren't you? Yeah, I'm gonna cut his hair. That's why I look like a toilet brush, Frigo. 
Yeah, you, you don't go to the barbers at all anymore, do you? <laughs> yes, I do. I come in here and you're my barber. Yeah, I've, I've cut his hair now for about four years. More? So like, before Jojo was born, right? Really? I think so. The first time we did it, we, we took so much time and we were evaluating and checking everything and we would never have got that done. Yeah. If Jojo was here. Yeah. I cut Jamie's hair. I did a good job you with that. You did like when, when, she, when she went really short hair. Yeah, she went it. from long hair to short hair. I did. She asked me to do it. Yeah. But he's told me to cut Jojo's hair before, but I'm yeah. like, no way. I can't do that here. That was a nice day out for him. No, I think it's different when someone else takes control like that, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. yeah. With him, if you were doing his hair, he'd probably just go, Mummy, I'm, I'm bored now. I'm halfway through. He'd like, just mess around. One side long. He'd just mess around the whole time yeah anyway speaking of jojo he's in there at the moment having a snack i think he's dressed as a dalmatian dog he's what he's dressed as a dalmatian he wanted, I've, I've got to say this that's what he wants to wear today so i'm gonna go and do some reading with jojo i think we're gonna read the gruffalo oh the gruffalo yeah and the gruffalo's child two books oh freegan i'm gonna ask this of you who's a gruffalo fan who knows the gruffalo well let comment below if you're a gruffalo or a gruffalo's child one Pick your favourite. Oh, They're yeah. They're awesome books, man. I think The Gruffalo's my favourite because it's like the first one and everything. Yeah. But The Gruffalo's Child, first time I read that, I was yeah. just like, oh, oh, I'm not scared. Oh. Said The Gruffalo's Child. Yeah, it is pretty cool. Who was quiet in a deep, dark wood? The mouse found the nut and the nut was good. <laughs> I'm just getting my head around. There's a dog sat on our bed. There's, a, there's not. There's a dog sat on our bed reading the Gruffalo. My goodness. Next level. I couldn't find the Gruffalo's child, could we? Yeah, I don't know where that is. <laughs> Hello, cute little doggy. This is the same one Jamie had, isn't it? Yes, yeah, the same one. She used to go to school at that on Muffy days at like eight years old and whatever else, didn't she? Yeah. That was so cool. Yeah, on the days when you're allowed to wear like your own clothes. It's like wear whatever you want and she was like, well I'm using that to yeah. my full advantage. So she used to wear this. It's like the proper Disney Dalmatian one as well. Mm. I'm not sure what the um, name of this uh, character is though. The one with the red collar. Free gang, if anyone knows what the character is, do you know Jojo? Jojo? He's in a doggy trance. He's probably thinking, why don't we watch 101 Dalmatians today? Because yeah. you got it recently, didn't we? <laughs> You seem very excited, that gone gallop away. And he's gone. Oh, did you uh, replace The Gruffalo's Child with a couple yeah. of other books? We could, I couldn't find The Gruffalo's Child. I don't know what's happened, but I will find it. It'll be around here somewhere. That's a good one, though. So, <laughs> That's a good one. This is a brilliant book. It's called Open Very Carefully, A Book With Bites. But it's so random. It just goes off and you're like, am I reading this for real? Yeah. But it's the kind of stuff that goes on in my brain for randomness and... It's got a hole in the back. Exactly. And... <laughs> Classic. <laughs> <laughs> he used to read that to him when he was so young, wasn't yeah. it? Yeah, he still loves it though. What's this one called, Doggy? Sometimes I like to curl up an apple. Oh. <laughs> you sound like a very old dog. You're just the cutest little dog, aren't you? Okay, <laughs> yeah, put your head down again. <laughs> no licking the camera, Doggy. Once I've cut Daddy's hair, shall we watch 101 Dalmatians? <laughs> yeah? Well, there's only 100, he's the one. You're gonna have to jump in the screen. Detective work. We've got more detective work to do, have we? Yeah. Oh, so that stuff out there is like, that's phase two. The phase Because I heard you running around playing it earlier. I've seen so many of these yellow pieces of paper around the place, so. Getting lost. I got those for you. Yeah. <laughs> as an anniversary present. Right, Katie, you're going to cut my hair now, aren't you? Headless person. <laughs> for those of you that watch all of our videos, you'll know that if I get my hair cut, sometimes Jojo just won't leave us be and he'll just come and jump in and mess around while I get my hair cut and make it really difficult and get covered in hair himself as well. But at least this time he's sat down having a snack and watching 101 Dalmatians. He's not dressed as a Dalmatian anymore. So hopefully mummy can get this done without any interruptions. I'm not holding my breath. I wouldn't do that. You'd probably pass out and wouldn't be able to cut my hair. Yeah, let's see anyway. Let's I'm see not holding my breath either. Let's see, I'll, I'll try and do it quickly. Let's see. Yeah. Hello. Hello, mate. How are you doing in your haircut? I'm fine. It looks freaky. It's not look freaky. Well, with the hair at the back, it looks freaky. What have you done at the back? <laughs> What the f <laughs> No, 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 no. Aragog is not getting a trim today. I've got his hair on me now. I'm getting like some hybrid bush around my head. 
Uh, uh, so actually directly on my head? Yeah. Oh, my hands oh. on your head and then... No. Please, for once, can we do this in peace? Daddy, I've got a present for you. What? Uh, what the hell is that? <laughs> <laughs> Are you just carrying on while they're on theirs? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I think I should go back to a barber's. No, I'm the barber. Well, then you need to sort your staff out. We're Ow! Oh, oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> she trod on my foot freak. Oh, you're laughing now, are you? The kisses mean nothing. <laughs> I don't know what is going on behind me. There's a beat down going on. The cushions are monsters and I'm trying to defeat them with my super strength. <gasps> cool. You keep doing it as long as you keep doing it over there. It's like a toupee now. Hi, I'm a game show host. All right, if we're all done, I will go and jump in the shower and then after I come out, I'll give him some of my time before he destroys this room. You having a good play with the Lego men, mate? Yeah. What's happening? This guy really wants to take over the world, so he's like making all these minions, but there's also a good guy somewhere around here, and yeah, he's trying to stop him. Daddy! What are you doing? <laughs> no. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> I've got an idea, babe. Hold the camera a minute. Hold the camera a minute. And you like it. <laughs> <laughs> Go. We are. I'm upside down, you idiot. Whoa. I'm gonna be sick with that. Oh. <laughs> oh. Well shot. Get over your head. It's gonna go through the top. Look. It's off his line. Oh, off the bar. Over his head. Oh, thanks. You're gonna love this. Go, go, no. Hi. Go. You're not singing anymore. What's that? You've got a song to sing out of Oh, Oh, Lali. Oh. Woo! Knocked him over. Get down. Get down. What was that? Oh, closet back from the gates of hell. <laughs> Go! On. Right, guys, guys, I hate to break up the party, but can we open the lovely packages now? Are the boxes with Yeah! Them? Yes. First, I'm going to make pin art with a dinosaur. Ah. Comment below, free gang, who's ever used pin art to oh, call look, Sting? Daddy's made the dinosaur. Should I do my face? Yeah, go and do your face. The dinosaur stuck! No! Pin art as we know it is finished. No, there we go. Do. When you do it really slowly is when it's freaky. Oh my god, that's freaky. <laughs> let, let me see. Let me do it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's got the cutest one. Oh my goodness. My baby's trapped. Do it with your normal face. Well, it looks like um, a baby looks like in the womb. You just oh, see a yeah. sleeping baby. Let's put the dimple in his chin. <laughs> so, Kate, you're going to have to go and pick up Sam yeah, very soon from the airport, aren't you? Yeah. And uh, Jojo's gone off. Has he made a potion and just yeah? Into you know, if you watch all of our videos, you know Jojo makes potions all the time. He's quite the so, potion maker. Yeah, he's just made a potion and he's drinking it in Jamie's room. And probably morphing into some sort of creature as we speak. Don't tell Jamie. And if you are Jamie, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Don't tell yourself. Yeah, don't tell yourself. So, the boxes. A few weeks ago, we met a lovely lady called Victoria, and we got chatting, and she liked us so much, she decided to send us two boxes of goodies. So we're gonna open those boxes of goodies and share them with you guys now. Well, we're not gonna share them, we're gonna show you what we've got. Yeah, how are we gonna share them with everybody? Mm -hmm. I'm actually really, really excited yeah. about these. Come down like that. That's easy. Yeah, normally you have to just get stuck in. Normally, it takes so long to get into these boxes. All secret paper hiding your stuff. Break the seal carefully. Ah. That was a very careful. Nah. Oh. Can you smell that coming out? Oh, 
Don't bury your head in there. Oh, I love this stuff, look. No, 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 no. I do not like this stuff. We've done unboxing before, and this stuff has been involved, and it has not been my best friend. I'm cold. <laughs> God, damn. This is not how this video is supposed to go. We've got some coconut water. <laughs> Lemonade flavoured coconut water. <laughs> It's the point of one to land on armor again. Well, it wasn't me, it was the kids that did so it. You, you were pulling it out then like you were. I thought about it, I thought about it. You encouraged them. So all of these products that we've got here, they come from a company called Greener Beauty, which is Victoria's company. And what they're all about is it's a marketplace for personal care, healthcare products, so like shampoos, conditioners, toothpaste, beauty products as well. But they're all cruelty free and they're all environmentally friendly as well. So nothing too hazardous, nothing that's damaging the planet, mm. which is really cool because it's consolidating all of these different brands and different companies together in one place. Yeah, so we've got some stuff which is specific for children as well. And it's child sensitive. Yeah. So that means that it's not going to be hazardous to their skin. We've got some bubble bath. Jojo is going to love, Jojo loves bubbles. He hasn't had a bubble bath in so long. I know, I know. My goodness. I might have a bubble bath. Ah, suitable for sensitive and eczema prone skin. That is good, yeah. Same here with the hand wash, also made by Charles Farm. That'd be really good. Oh, you'll like this, mummy. So this is uh, some hair, a hair care product from Green People. It's a King Wine Avocado Hair Serum. Ooh. Avocado is good for the hair in that, right? Especially today. Oh my goodness. Yeah, it couldn't have come at a better time. I'm going to use this. Yeah, whack some on it before yeah. you go out. I bet that will make it feel better. And this is Kingfisher Charcoal Toothpaste. And this one's really good for whitening, isn't it? Yeah. We've uh, used this brand before because it's fluoride free, yeah. cruelty free, but I've not used the charcoal one and it's supposed to make your teeth really white and I'm just obsessed with having white teeth for some reason. I don't know why. My teeth aren't even that white, but I just like, I'm just like, I've, I've had them whitened like before in the past, but it's just really expensive and they put, they use a lot of chemicals, so this should be good. Mummy, would you like to do the graceful throwing away of the box? Whee! Whee! Box, this one, however, will demand some rigorous grabbing and wrestling. Oh, yeah, this is the tough one, yeah. Don't try and act all delicate. Get in there, mummy. Come on. That's it, that's it. Oh, it's through your face, I've never done Oh, oh no, this you're so is close. what we were talking about earlier about normal boxes. Don't ah. destroy the box, we can reuse it. Get scissors now. Get some scissors. I've done it, I'm in, we're in. The scissors are not needed, I will not give in to scissors. We're in. Hey. Why do these things always turn into a crazy business? Oh wow. Whoa. Oh, I'm expecting the pop in. No, see, it is you. So what have we got in here? Oh Jason. Oh. Oh, we've used Jason products before, but yeah. not used this. Sea Fresh mouthwash. Spearmint mouthwash. Ooh. Good. Oh, it's got a seal. It's got a seal on it. <laughs> How does the seal smell? <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh. Also got another product from Child's Farm as well. This is a moisturizer as well. Apparently this can be good for, it says as well, for eczema and any other skin allergies and problems, isn't it? Yeah. Or another toothpaste from Kingfisher. This is the mint one. Yeah. Again, it's fluoride free, it's cruelty free. And what I like about this product is they tell you all of the ingredients, exactly where they come from and what they do. And having that on any sort of product, that's just so rare, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. That sort of detail. Fluoride free as well. You don't want to put fluoride in your body. Ah, oh, this is really helpful. Incognito anti mosquito insect repellent. Yes, I it right. Incognito anti mosquito. Yeah, that's really handy because mosquitoes carry some bad diseases. That's yeah, prevention. that's really handy because we do a lot of traveling and. They're even around in the UK at the moment, aren't yeah, they? Yeah, I got bitten the other day. I got bitten on the face. Did you? Yeah, it was you. Oh, right. <laughs> <laughs> no. Anti Bob sprays in the next box. Oh, this is a Faith in Nature, that's the brand, coconut conditioner. Okay. Oh, coconut conditioner. Is there a seal? Ah, no. you can smell it. Oh. It smells like. Oh, my goodness. That smells like good to eat, but you're not going to eat it. You probably could eat it. I'm not going to eat it. No, you could probably. Should we do a taste test? No. Next video coming up, comment below if you know. And last product is these Gento Aloe Vera Wet Wipes. Earth Friendly Baby. Oh, look at that. Look at the little baby there. I've been looking for wet wipes like this for ages, ones that are biodegradable. Yes. Because wet wipes aren't that good for the environment. No, you can't flush them out the toilet. Really. Yeah, we sometimes just need them like... On the go. On the go. Yeah. When Jojo gets... Well, when Katie gets mucky, she yeah. needs to wipe herself. Yeah. Like, eating in the car and stuff be, like that. Yeah, just when he gets mucky in the car and stuff like that. But yeah, 100% biodegradable. Brilliant. Free from artificial fragrances, colours and alcohol. That's what you want to hit. Good. So yeah. 
So that's it. So thank you, Victoria. Thank you, Green and Beauty, yes. It's not only good that they have all of these different products on there, they tell you about different services that are cruelty free. If you want to go to a spa, get a massage or a tattoo, from someone that uses you know, cruelty free or environmentally friendly products, they can list them all on there. If you have any sort of business or know someone that has that sort of business, you can get into contact and get it listed on there. Are you gonna put the link in the description? I am gonna put the link in the description. Any of you guys that are interested in cruelty free beauty products or personal care products, Links in the description, go and check them out. And yeah, you can find some good stuff on there. Tell them Bob sent you. And me. Tell them Bob sent you. Hey, I sent them. <laughs> Fine, delicately balanced there. Yay. No, tripping. You want to do this, do you? No, 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 we've got to tidy up. <laughs> Please do not let Jojo get wind of this. No, put it in the box quick, and let's hide it. Quick. Naughty mummy. So thank you for watching this video guys, leave your comments below on what you think of these products or any other comments you have about this video, maybe you've got your eye on the product already, maybe you've cheekily gone and opened another tab while I'm talking right now and you're looking at the site already, I will let you off on this occasion, make sure you comment below, we love reading your comments. And we read all of the comments. We do. But before we round up this video, I just want to give some lovely shout outs to some of you lovely free gang who have requested them. So shout out to the following people. Shout out to Grace Jolliffe, Ellie Slime Squishes, great name. Oh. Lisa O'Shaughnessy, Alicia Scrivener, and last shout out, this was via Instagram, from Makeup by Ruby, who was inspired by us to be vegan, and has inspired to make her own channel as well. So that's great that you know you felt you were inspired by us. Well done you. Wish you the best on your journey. And good luck with your channel. Yes, best of luck with your channel. And thank you so much guys for always requesting your shout outs and leaving your comments. If any of you guys ever want a shout out, just leave them in the comments below. We'll try and get it in the next few videos. There may be some of you who have requested ones and you're like, where's mine? I assure you, they are coming. But if you think it's been missed, comment again below. We'll definitely get it. And if you're new to this channel, you like following our lives, seeing what we get up to, what we unbox, what we don't unbox, what we, where we travel, all the fun things we do, we'd love it if you subscribe to our channel. Comment below if you want to see what we don't unbox. Yeah. Is that what you just said? There's a, a sandwich I didn't unbox right there. Right there. If you're already subscribed, hit that notification bell so you're kept up to date on when we do upload videos. You don't want to miss out, I'm assuring you of this. We will see you guys in the next video. Thank you so much for watching. Peace out. Peace out.